T-Combo Washer Dryer Disassembly. Press to open the filter cover assembly. Pull out the drawer, then pull up to remove it. Squeeze the handle and take out the filter assembly. Press the center of the lower door to reveal the auto detergent and softener reservoirs, then remove them. Press the hook at the bottom of the deco. While maintaining pressure on the hook, lift the deco away from the body of the product. When the hook fully disengages, lower the deco to remove it. Insert a small flathead screwdriver or plastic spudger into the deco hole and lift slightly. While maintaining pressure, slide the panel until it is unhooked from the product. Unhook the drain hose and remove the detergent box cover. Remove the screws that were revealed. Open the door and loosen the bolts from the hinge. Lift and pull to remove the door. Remove the two screws from around the door latch. Remove the diaphragm wire clamp and loosen the diaphragm. Remove these screws from the back of the top panel. Slide the top panel back and remove it. Remove the four screws from the top of the product. Disassemble the front panel connector. Depress and disengage any hooks from the front frame. Lift and pull to remove the front frame. Remove the screws from the front rails. Remove the front rail and unclip the wiring from it. Remove the final screw from the top of the frame plate and remove it. Take out the screws to remove the wire cover. Disassemble these three connections and set aside the harness. Take the hoses out of their hooks. Remove these three screws. Remove the red connector. Remove both of the hot input valve screws. Pull any wire harnesses and hoses out of the way so that you can unclip and release the duct cover. Disassemble the connectors shown. Release the clamp to remove the hose from the membrane. Remove the screw from the duct clamp and remove it. Separate the membrane from the duct. Remove the hoses as shown.
squeeze the tabs on both sides of the pressure sensor connector with pliers and pull it out. Unclip any remaining wiring. Ensure that the rear duct is clear of any connections or wiring. You can now remove the base assembly. Pull forward to remove the bottom bracket. Disconnect any remaining clips and wiring. To access the main PCB housing, we can tilt the product back to expose the bottom panel. Remove the screw from the housing. Shift the housing from the underside to release it. It can now be pulled through the bottom hole for service. Remove all connectors and hoses from the right pump, as shown. Remove the screw to disassemble the pump part. Remove all hoses and connections from the left pump, as shown. You can now remove the part.